Welcome back. This Earth Day, that is the 22nd of April, we take you on a special journey inside the world's largest mangrove. Sundarbans in the Khulna district of Bangladesh is home to the royal felines and hundreds of species of wildlife. Smita Sharma went on the tiger trail. While the Royal Bengal Tiger could not be spotted, its tails abound and so do challenges to maintain the delicate balance between human livelihood and nature. Where the green waters and the green tree covers mingle, where boundaries are meaningless and where time has no reason to race. Where humans respect the forest and its creatures, and animals provide for human sustenance. Radha and Krishna, these nearly eight year old otters tied to a rope, dive through the waters and catch fish for their masters. Occasionally, the masters need to bribe them with a fish or two, or Radha Krishna might just choose to rebel and gulp down some of the catch on their own. Sundarbans is a reminder of how the earth should be. Spread across 10,000 square kilometers in India and Bangladesh, the world's largest single block mangroves is a delight for those who want to be with nature. Okay, so these are the Sundari trees and Sundarbans. That's been named after these trees. Sundar would be beautiful. Bans is of course the forest. So these are beautiful forests and attributed. The name is attributed to this Sundari tree itself. Home to some 24 species of mangroves alone, the Bangladeshi Sundarbans though are also fraught with conservation challenges. This forest always vulnerable to the cyclone. It's in the coast, north coast of Bay of Bengal. I mean, north coast of Indian Ocean is the Bay of Bengal. Then it's it's always open to the sea, big sea, and it's facing lot of cyclones everywhere, every year. <laughs> But it's not just the hundreds of species of trees, birds, crocodiles, spotted deer or wild boars. Sundarbans is home to the striped Bengal tigers. And to catch a glimpse of these handsome royal beasts is the dream of every tourist. India today too got on such a tiger trail. But whispers, posters warning of tiger attacks, tiger hills, Stories of tiger spotting and claw marks on trees was as lucky as we could get through hours of jungle trek. माने डिप बने अमी माने जंगले भीतरे अमी हेते जाच्छी तो होले यार कि हमारे साथ यारों इस टाइम भाई सिलो तो हम जार पर देखी जे सामने माने धोप जाने भीतरे बाग सिलो अमरा हटात बुझते भाई नहीं तो ये हेते जाच्छी तसाइड दिए तो हम वो ही बाग अपना ना मादेर के माने टारगेट करे शेयर टा हुम की दिसे तो हुम की जोखन दिसे तो खन वो ही हुम की माने गौरजोन दिया पड़े अमरा भाई पे वो खन ते के दोनों से लम। Though a glimpse of the tiger can run the risk of turning unlucky too, sometimes specially for local fishermen and forest officers. डाकती बाया से कुमार बाया से बागेर बाया से ताई शब्दाने दरी अस्तिया बे खाले दी। in Sundarbans, they say, you might not see the tiger, but the tiger is watching you. Like Sheikh Abdullah, another forest ranger, Shamapada, working for the last 16 years here, also has tales of his trysts with the tigers. Actually, 
এই জায়গাতে ওইদিন আমরা নিয়ে গেছে জোয়ারের সময় A recent joint Indo-Bangladeshi study estimates the number of Bengal tigers in the Sundarbans at 182 with 76 on the Indian side and 106 on the Bangladeshi side. The modern camera trapping methodology is considered more accurate than the pug mark counts. But while the number of tigers in this region have been on the rise for the first time in a century, the number of Bengal tigers still continues to be a huge worry. With climate change, rising sea levels and pollution from steamers and cargo vessels and developing industrial zones being the biggest threat to these royal striped cats. Like uh, if one meter rise the sea level, we believe almost 90% or more will go underwater. That means Sundarbans will go underwater. But most importantly, these forests need to protect the big cats from the biggest threats poachers and this needs human solutions ar so dakar jara ache eder ko e korte hobe ei je ei boner bhitor jate dukti na pare ebong amader bhalo bhabe protect dite hobe lok bolo badan dorkar e lok boler dorkar ache aro ostrer dorkar ache janbahoner dorkar ache Sundarbans is the heart of the maritime border between India and Bangladesh which was settled peacefully through international arbitration in recent times Though even before it was settled, the beasts in the jungle did not need visas or passports to cross over into each other's territory. These dense mangroves drive home the lesson, stop dividing the earth and mankind and learn to coexist in peace. Unlike the Indian Sundarbans, the Bangladeshi mangroves do not have human habitats, but they are home to hundreds of species of wildlife, flora, fauna, more importantly, the big cats. But they are ecologically fragile and a long-term plan, vision is needed to ensure that these forests are conserved along with uh, climate adaptability and also to ensure the livelihoods of thousands of people in this region are sustained even as they get access to clean energy. Here at the Sundarbans with the journalist Zaheer Bagh, this is Smita Sharma for India Today. That is coming in the bulletin. Vijay Malia has refused to divulge details of overseas assets to the consortium of banks that have fi filed the case against him. Malia has filed an affidavit. The sense did not reflect the true Indian cultural ethos, did not repre uh, represent our plurality. But do you believe that Asaudin OAC, because he said.